Indian tribe along with Oregon Department of Fish and Wildlife are removing smallmouth bass as well as some other non-native invasive species from the Coquille River. They have been here for over a decade and they are having decimating effects on salmonids, so fall chinook and other salmon species, as well as lamprey eels, um, which are a tribal of first food. So the electric fishing boat, um, how it operates is we have a generator that I, that's underneath the seat I'm, I'm at. Um, and then there's a, a box in the steering console that converts the electricity, which is an AC electricity, into a DC electricity, um, which is a little bit easier on the fish. It just kind of stuns them. Um, we have a, a positive and a, a negative. So the positive sticks out on the fiberglass poles out in front of the boat. And then the negative is the boat itself. Uh, once they're stunned, uh, the netters up front, they can see them, they usually turn. You can see the white bellies in the fish and they net the fish and we put them in a, in a uh, tub here in the boat. You know, our culture is, is based around the return of the salmon. It's our sustenance. Um, it marked the beginning of fall and the salmon's return. It just, it plays a very important part in every part of our lives and, and we use every part of it to uh, sustain the tribe and, uh, and everyone, you know, eats fish and, and, and in that, uh, the supply needs to be, you know, maintained in this river to keep it going. Thank <laughs> you.